On Good Friday, a pipeline operated by Exxon Mobil ruptured. Adam's going to tell you all about it, so start focusing now. So that is a pipeline that is busted and is flooded the neighborhood. The Pegasus pipeline carries up to 90,000 barrels of crude oil extracted from tar sands every day from Illinois to Texas. On Good Friday, Exxon Mobil's pipeline ruptured near Mayflower, Arkansas, and thousands of gallons spilt into the town and the surrounding area. Exxon say oil stopped spilling out of the pipeline at 3 a.m. the next day and the cleanup operation began. Vacuum trucks came into town, clearing up the mess, reducing the smell of oil in the air and putting down 3,600 meters of boom to protect the nearby Lake Conway. The next day, a spokesman from Exxon said, we were just in the nick of time. Reports from the scene say a no fly zone was established around the lake by the Federal Aviation Authority and it's claimed Exxon were in control of it. And on the ground, reporters alleged that they were threatened with arrest if they went into the area. But JNL Radical Media took the chance and went down to the marshland and this is what they found. Anybody wondering what those Exxon paper towels look like? What the fuck? We asked Exxon how much oil got into the lake and they say none, but it has definitely got into the wetlands and it was running down the streets and getting into people's gardens. You gotta get that stuff off your hand. I know. We spoke to Exxon Mobil and they said the no-fly zone had been lifted last week and they weren't aware of any arrests made. We've got a link in the description to their cleanup operation if you want to take a look. Also, if you like this video, check out the two videos to my right. We've got a video about green, power's bright new future and fracking. But most importantly, hit subscribe and we'll see you again next time.